going on guys it's nick from surfcast and the island back at you with another video today's topic of discussion is actually going to be an appreciation post shout out to my buddy gion aka lore walker for the merchandise i've acquired over the past couple times i've seen him at the shows in person fishing whatever we're doing i'm um, always keeping it real um i got much much closer with him i'd say over this past year or so i started fishing with his crew um several guys in that group uh just a group of very solid guys you know very 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 friendly very open to their ideas their techniques i picked up a lot from them as i believe they picked up a lot from me and my experiences um neither here nor there um i don't have any shirts or anything of that matter i'll probably make more videos going forward once i buy more merch going forward um but for now it's just i'm going over hats textures designs what's good for what weather that type of deal um so without further ado i'll uh, get into it okay so the uh the first hat i'm actually gonna go over is the foam trucker hat love this color that light tan mocha coffee color whatever you want to call it really very 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 solid i love it i dig it probably one of my favorite colorways in this design um as you can see it says lore walker surf casting with the embedded logo on the side stitched i don't know if you guys can see that too well but there you have it um very very comfortable rim on the inside as well i can't tell that some sort of i don't know synthetic fur or synthetic wool um, very lightweight, very cool. Um, get this hat wet, it'll dry off very comfortable. It's almost like an absorbent wicking material. Um, front half of it, wicking material, the rim all the way around the lid, wicking material. Back is all pretty much more than I'd say, I'd say three quarters of this hat. So the back end of the hat's netted, as you can see, and it's a snapback um snap back strap backs are great you can adjust them you're not going to be limited to um you know one size as you know one size fits all for this hat you can adjust it um just like any snap back like i'm wearing the montauk msa hat um this again fits perfect you can deal with the spray wet conditions great for the warmer weather as well you're not going to get too hot as compared to the next two hats I'm going to talk about. Um, just a very big uh, fan of this hat. Wore a lot during the spring. Very, very comfortable. And again, all this is available on his website. Just click the link in bio on at Lore Walker on Instagram. Uh, on to the next hat. I'm going to go kind of like in gradual order of, you know, time of year I'd wear. So this would be like late spring pretty much all through the summer this would be a great hat um approaching fall early winter um we have i believe this is called the wanderer or nomad hat um it has a different logo but same thing lore walker i believe it's all shores fishing and the establishment date on there this one is a strap back similar to what i was talking about with the snapback easily adjustable fits any type of head shape head size you get the idea i'm um, going through materials as um as opposed to mostly uh wicking synthetic foam absorbent material this is more of like a um a natural wool um best i could compare this to it's almost i don't know not exactly like it but it has a similar feel to that of like a mitchell ness hat um some of the snapbacks for basketball teams baseball teams that type of deal it's gonna get a little bit more along that texture maybe a, i'd say more wool in that case the rim is just same thing straight stitched on um looks like wool same thing all around um during the warmer weather this would be i'd say a little bit too too hot this is more of like here early fall through the fall even into the early winter i'd wear this i'd rock this um early spring that type of deal 
and it also fits great. A lot of room in the front, back, same thing as this hat I spoke about. Um, same thing, love this hat. Um, so that covers the Wanderer hat, the foam trucker. Last but not least, I'm gonna talk about the uh, Lore Walker beanie. I love, love, love this color. Probably my favorite color um, in this design. This is the uh, black over white marble. And as you guys could guess, this would be good for late fall, all through the winter, early spring. It's snowing outside, it's nasty outside. I'm probably not doing as much fishing as I should or possibly could do during that time of year. But again, solid fit, love it. I love to rock it. Um, I used it a couple times freshwater fishing over the winter and that type of deal, but neither here nor there. Um, standard materials, it's just basic knitting. Um, and it has his logo on it. I believe it's very similar to that of what was on the foam trucker. It just says Lore Walker Surf Casting. Um, that's pretty much going to wrap up this video. It was just going to be a quick appreciation post. He also has awesome, awesome long sleeves and sweatshirts that I'm going to get my hands on, you know, sooner rather than later. Love those new designs coming out. Even the ones featuring, you know, some of the legends like Billy the Greek and those guys. So very, very cool collabs. Look forward to seeing more collabs and um, look forward to seeing you soon, Lore Walker. So everyone else. Look forward to seeing you as well, people I know, and that's pretty much it. Have a good one, guys.